Okay, guys. Um, uh, morning, everybody. Um, my name is uh, Kevin Murray. I'm the Coxino Camogie coach um, for the last number of years. Uh, my session is going to be a bit different from from Derek's. And, uh, most of my is going to be all specific game um, games, uh, based from cognitive games to conditioning games to consequence value games. Um, and it's going to be pretty rapid. They're going to get very little break in the next 30 minutes. Um, I'll try to stay by the sideline so I can just describe how the games are working. Okay, thanks. Okay, and play. Same here, guys. Get a ball. Blues on the ball. Off we go. Inside the grid. Yeah, just hunt the ball. Yeah, off we go. So it's just a pace of the ball. Please, pace of the ball. Let's go, next two players in. Let's go, play away, play away. Yeah. The other two players out. Get on the whistle, guys, you change the two. Another two arms is in, let's go. Okay, freeze for a second. Just one thing on the technical side of things. You'll see lots of players playing these small style games and they hold the hurley this way. Okay, they're all running around like this. If the ball is short, it takes them a split second to lengthen their hurley. So every time we play, we play this way. So we can reach and grab the ball and basically we're ready to strike when we play the game. So your boss is always above your wrist. Okay, this time when Blue's past the ball, you go down your tummy, someone else jumps over you to release you. Okay, go, play, let's go. Every time you pass the ball, you should be down your tummy. Okay, one turnover. Well done. Already, since I added another variable in, guys, it's already gone. Hit may There's lots of mayhem there. They're getting lost. They're forgetting about their team player. Okay, let's go again. One more round. Go. Yeah, every time you pass, you go down. Come on, Dad. Freeze, 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 freeze. You look at this group. Okay, now it's a 2v2. Okay, so that's just one conditioning game I do generally to warm up their brain. Okay, in we come. So can I get eight blues and eight uh, oranges? So blues come to me here for a second. Oranges, can you go over there for me? Okay, where's my eight blues? Okay, give yourself a number. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. In your eight blues, let's go. Quickly, nice and loud. Okay, do you know your number? Okay, you have to pass through your number. Okay, does that make sense? Okay, we've got eight, they have to pass through the numbers. Okay, the other team doesn't know their numbers. Okay, let's go. Play inside the 45, there's eight. I'm on eight there. Possession game. Okay, ball is with blues. Let's go, where's my eight blues? Okay, possession game. Do other blues, just clean the, clean the pitch for me, please. Okay, all over the place, guys. Let's go. You have to keep possession. You have to go through. Who's the ball, guys? Who's the ball? Blues should have the ball. Yeah, Blues, over with your team. Yeah. Okay, play, let's go. Game on. He's asleep, 70 is a bit of sleep. Okay, stay out there guys. Okay, so the number of players, number three has to understand the number of players that he's interested in. How many? 
Two. Yeah, the person he's getting from the person he's giving it to. So we walk in threes a lot of the time, right? So a lot of the stuff I'll do is lots of threes. Ball plus two. Okay, so the interesting thing there is, if you're number three, four has to be already awake to where, where the next pass should be. Okay, we'll play again. Okay, let's play again. Off we go. Okay, game on. Sound asleep. Where's your next pass? Where's your next? <laughs> Isolated. Left on his own. The person he was receiving the ball from was sound asleep. Didn't create an angle for a pass. Okay, in we come everybody. So the oranges, did they notice anything? What should they notice? Anybody? Patterns. Say it again? Patterns. Patterns, absolutely. Okay, they should have recognized the pattern. So if I'm number three, they should have recognized the person who's giving to me and who am I giving to regularly, quick enough. Okay, without knowing the sequence. Okay, let's play one more time. And I'm gonna call out an instruction and I wanna see what happens. Okay, so. Can the eight just stand in front there of the, of the, of the crowd for me? Orange, just get over here for me quickly, nice and quick. Change your numbers, please, quickly. Change your numbers. Pop out there for a second. I want to see what you're recognizing and what you're seeing. Yeah, numbers. Yeah. Okay. So I'm now changing them and seeing how quick can they find a the pattern. And when you hear me say reverse, you reverse the pattern. So if you're four, you'll give it to five, and you turn around, you're going to give it to three. Same two people you're going to be interested in. Okay, off you go and play, guys. Okay, possession again. Let's go. Okay, quickly. Now you need to understand the two people that's involved with you. Okay. What happens when I say reverse? Yeah, you switch it. Okay, meaning the person you're giving it to, you know, you're getting it from. Okay, spread out. You've all the pitch to work with, guys. Can I get a ball there for a sec? Who's up? Yeah. Okay, ball on! Where's his help? Who's, who are you passing to? Well, well done, Oranges! Well, well, sorry, sorry, it's my name, sorry. I think I've seen more of Derry this morning than uh, I've done the last number of years. Um, I think Kevin has explained what he's doing, I suppose. The main thing is just trying to get the pattern and your defending player to realise what's happening. Um, after a while they should come on and they should know exactly where the ball is going next. Okay, and we come. So you can see some guys have switched off and make it, make it really, really hard for the person who's on the ball. Really, really hard. Okay, this place should flow if everybody's on. 